I see a lot of people out there giving really bad advice in the Linux community, so today I wanted to talk about one of the more common pieces of bad advice I see people give, especially newer Linux users, is, hey, you should be running Arch Linux because Arch Linux will help you learn Linux. It will teach you about Linux. You will never learn Linux by running Ubuntu or Linux Mint, or Manjar, or whatever it happens to be, right? You need to be running Arch. And when people go to these forums, these subreddits, and say, hey, I'm running Kubuntu, and I'm having this problem, I get this error, you know, I need to try to fix this particular situation on my machine. Well, if you'd have just run Arch Linux, you'd actually know about Linux, and you'd be able to fix your machine. And that's just stupid. That's just bad advice. For one thing, who says that that person even wants to learn more about Linux? People sometimes just want to use an operating system. They just want to use their computer. And honestly, that's just ridiculous advice anyway, telling somebody they should use a distribution like Arch. Or sometimes you'll see people say the same thing about Gentoo. Gentoo, you'll learn so much about Linux. Well, if you really wanted to learn as much about Linux as possible through installing a distribution, then everyone would recommend Linux from scratch, right? Which is literally building Linux a complete Linux operating system from the ground up, and I'm talking about from the very base up. It's practically like a stage one Gentoo installation, except even worse than that, right? It takes sometimes several days, sometimes a couple of weeks to install Linux from scratch, depending on what kind of machine you're installing it on, if it's not a very powerful machine because it has to do so much compilation. And it teaches you a lot of the nuts and bolts about what makes a Linux operating system. But not everybody wants to do that. I'm a Linux geek. I don't want to do that, right? But you could say, well, I don't really know enough about Linux unless I actually install Linux from scratch. Guys, that's, that's not what most people want to do. Most people just want to actually use an operating system. They want to install something and go. Stop with trying to make people use distributions because it's going to somehow magically make them some kind of power user or really super smart. That's not the way this works. And it's not just with Linux that you see these kinds of snobs out there, right? These distro snobs. You also see it with other pieces of software, such as Emacs. Emacs, of course, there's many distributions, many different frameworks that can be built around Emacs, such as Doom Emacs. I've done so many videos about Doom Emacs, and a lot of you guys are trying out Doom Emacs because of my videos. And then you go to support forums or chat rooms or whatever it happens to be, and you're having an issue with Doom Emacs, with your config file, or you're getting errors, or whatever it happens to be, and you're asking these questions to the Emacs community, and occasionally you get these Emacs snobs that say, well, you should just be using standard GNU Emacs, and if you had used that, you would have had to build GNU Emacs from the ground up to make it into a proper text editor. And then you'd actually know more about Emacs. And then you'd really know what those error messages and you know how to fix your problems because it was so much harder for you to get to where you were going. If you just had to start with GNU Emacs, it would have made you a better Emacs user. That's ridiculous. Telling these people that their journey was too easy, they needed to take a rougher journey, a tougher journey to get to where they are, and that would have made them a better Emacs user. Maybe they just want to write some text. Maybe this person is a novelist. They installed Doom Emacs because they didn't want to fool with GNU Emacs, and they just want to open up their text editor and actually write something, right? Because they actually have work to do, right? Just like not everybody wants to install Linux from scratch. Not everybody wants to write Emacs from scratch either. Not everybody wants to install GNU Emacs and then have to install all the plugins and write this massive config file that does all the things out of the box that something like Doom Emacs already comes with. So don't look down on those people that use Doom Emacs. Don't view them as noobs because they use Doom Emacs rather than GNU Emacs like you do. And don't look down on those Ubuntu peasants because they use Ubuntu and you use Arch, by the way, right? Don't have that kind of snob mentality. We don't need that. Just because they made different software choices than you did, that doesn't make you better than them. It doesn't make them better than you. It just makes us different. And our differences, that's what makes this community special. Peace, guys.